welcome back to the next Juno New Origins video. The contract of this video is named Drew Orbit Rescue. I guess it's a repeating one and it is about rescuing some stranded vessels. All so this time it is a poor Drood from Simple Cruise who got stranded in orbit around Drew with a fuel leak and who needs rescue. We have to rendezvous with the stranded vehicle and use a 100% sized docking port to dock with it. And then we transfer the Drood to our vehicle and safely return him or her home. We only got 10 days to do it. Actually, I'm not 100% sure if we are required to dock with the stranded vehicle. It might as well be sufficient to do a spacewalk over to our vehicle. We'll see. Let's build a new vehicle and call it Rescuer Mark 1. We definitely need some component that can hold one or more droots. Let's pick the space capsule. It can hold one droot. We put a 100% sized docking port on top and two parachutes on the sides. Next, we are gonna need a heat shield on the bottom to survive re-entry heating. Next, we definitely need some RCS to perform the docking maneuver. Let's also add a small tank and the liquid fuel engine to perform the necessary course corrections. An additional tank is needed with monopropellant for the RCS thrusters. The rest of the rocket is pretty standard, first stage for getting up, second stage for circularization. Let's first check out where our poor Drood is located. First step is a pretty standard launch into low Drew orbit. Once we are there, we plan a maneuver node that will bring our closest encounter somewhere under 500 meters to the stranded vehicle. Once we are at the closest point, we switch our navball mode to target mode and burn retrograde until our relative velocity is near zero to hold that distance. From here we can burn towards the target to lower the distance until we are less than 100 meters away and then repeat and burn retrograde until our relative velocity is near zero. We are still on the wrong side of the other vehicle. The docking port is facing away from us, so let's move to the other side. From here on we can use RCS to maneuver precisely and switch to the docking port camera, which is a really nice feature, for the best perspective.
And we did it. We docked. It was not perfect, but hey, it worked in the end. Let's now get this route over to our space capsule. Let's try with a nice little spacewalk. Wow, those controls are very different from what I'm used to from Kerbal Space Program. I will really need some getting used to. But we finally made it to our space capsule. Time to undock and head home. Let's enjoy the nice visuals of re-entry and landing in a nice sunset setting. All right, so that gave us some million dollars and 10 tech points. We can also recover the vehicle and get another 2 million back. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and see you in the next video. Bye bye.